Hey everybody and welcome to Animal Planet Videos. In this video we will discover the top 10 cutest and most exotic animals in the world. Make sure to watch until number 1 because it's one of the cutest and most exotic animals in the world. Let's get right into it. Number 10. Finger Monkey. The finger monkey, weighing less than an apple, is the tiniest monkey on earth. They have the ability to leap over 30 times their body length across the treetops in the Amazon jungle. Finger monkeys are very social animals and live in groups of up to 7 to 8 members in the wild. They are very active and playful creatures that love to climb trees, jumping from branch to branch. As omnivore animals, finger monkeys can eat a variety of food. However, their favorite food is tree gum, resin, sap, and other fluids that trees secrete. These mini monkeys groom one another and sleep together in places close to where they eat, and that helps establish a social bond. They are fussy about keeping their fur in good shape. Plus, both of the finger monkey parents participate in raising the offspring. Interestingly, the older siblings also help taking care of the younger ones. The parents teach important parenting skills to their children and help them to be good parents themselves when they reach adulthood. Number 9. Sugar Glider the sugar glider is a small and nocturnal gliding possum belonging to the marsupial infraclass. The common name refers to its diet and its predilection for sugary foods and its ability to glide through the air like a flying squirrel. Sugar gliders are arboreal animals, meaning they live in trees where they use their long tails to glide between them. Their ability to glide comes from a soft membrane between their wrists and ankles called a patagium, and when they jump from a high place, they can glide up to 50 meters. Sugar gliders sleep during the day in nests located in tree hollows with up to 10 other adults, and they also climb trees using the sharp claws on their hands and feet to search for food. Sugar gliders usually give birth to one or two babies at a time. After birth, the tiny young, called joeys, migrate to the pouch where they remain for 70 to 74 days before they leave the pouch. Number 8. Tamandua the Tamandua is a small, furry mammal that is found in the tropical forests of South and Central America. These little guys are also known as anteaters, because they love to eat ants. The Tamandua has a long snout and a prehensile tail. They are excellent climbers and spend most of their time in trees where they use their tails to help them balance as they move around. They are mainly nocturnal creatures that feed on ants, termites, and other small insects. They use their strong sense of smell to locate their prey and their long and sticky tongue to capture their prey. They also have sharp claws that they use to dig into the nests of ants and termites and then lick up the insects with their long tongues. Apart from that, they're equipped with a chemical defense system to detect and avoid ants that sting. However, they are calm animals and usually keep to themselves, but if they feel threatened, they will use their powerful claws to defend themselves. Number 7. Pangolin Pangolins are sometimes mistaken as reptiles, but they are actually scaly-skinned mammals. The name pangolin, from the Malay meaning rolling over, refers to this animal's habit of curling into a ball when threatened, and they are the only mammal in the world covered in scales, which are made of keratin, the same protein that gives humans hair and nails. They feed mainly on ants and termites, using their long tongues to lap up the insects, Pangolins are nocturnal animals, so they spend most of the day sleeping in trees, hollow logs, or burrows in the ground. They are nocturnal and generally solitary animals. When they do interact, it is usually only to mate. Pangolins are very protective of their young and will even use their tails and scales to defend them from predators. Pangolins are excellent tree climbers, using their claws to grip the bark. They are cute, they are exotic, and they are definitely one of the most unique animals in the world. Number 6. Alinguido The Alinguido is a new mammal that was discovered in 2013 and is the first new mammal species to be discovered in the Americas in 35 years. The Alinguido is a small nocturnal animal that looks like a cross between a teddy bear and a house cat. They weigh about 900 grams and are about 35 and a half centimeters long, with a furry tail that is almost as long as their body. They are generally solitary animals, but sometimes they share their territory with another alanguido. 
These cute creatures are mostly active at night searching for food in the trees, where they mainly eat fruits and insects. And they also are very agile and excellent climbers, able to climb up trees and across branches with ease using their sharp claws to climb. Therefore, the Alanguido is an amazing new discovery and one of the cutest animals around. Number 5. Axolotl The axolotl is a cute and exotic animal that is native to Mexico. Axolotls are known for their ability to regenerate lost body parts. They can regrow their tail, limbs, spinal cord, and even their brains. And they can do this as many times as necessary in as little as three weeks. And even though they have friendly faces, it would be a stretch to call them sociable. They're solitary creatures that keep to themselves. They don't have any interest in humans, and they don't even spend time with their own kind. They spend most of their time hiding in the dark, murky waters and only come out to hunt for food such as worms, insects, tadpoles, crustaceans, and small fish. Since they're able to regenerate lost limbs and organs, they can sometimes confuse people who associate regenerative abilities with immortal sea creatures like hydras. But axolotls won't live forever. Actually, the average lifespan of an axolotl is around 10 to 15 years. Number 4. Selenodon the Selenodon is a small, rodent-like mammal that is only found in Cuba and Hispanolia. It is one of the few venomous mammals in the world and is only one of the rarest and most endangered. The Selenodon looks like a small, brown mouse-like creature with a long snout. They are nocturnal creatures that build tunnel systems in the wet soil to seek shelter and find a place to store the food that they have foraged. These venomous mammals have toxic saliva that they use to debilitate their prey. They have large incisors and their bite has been compared to the bite of a snake and it leaves a mark and causes pain that lasts for days. Depending on the intensity of the bite and the amount of toxic poison consumed, vital organs may also get damaged and lead to death. However, they are not aggressive animals and only attack when they feel threatened. So if you're ever lucky enough to see a selenodon in the wild, be sure to give it a wide berth. These little guys may be cute, but they're also quite dangerous. Number 3. Water Opossum The water opossum is a semi-aquatic, web-footed marsupial found along tropical rivers, streams, and lakes from Mexico to Argentina. These cute little creatures are excellent swimmers, and they use their long tails for balance as they paddle through the water in search of food. They have a varied diet that includes fish, crustaceans, snails, insects, and even small mammals. Though they are mostly active at night, water opossums can occasionally be seen during the day sunning themselves on rocks or logs. They are very good at climbing and will often build nests high up in trees. These fascinating animals are not often seen by humans, but they play an important role in the ecosystem by helping to control the populations of fish, crustaceans, and other small animals that they prey upon. It is also the only living marsupial in which both sexes have a pouch. When their young are born, they climb into their mother's pouch in order to nurse. And while females are carrying offspring, males often circle them as a means of defense. Number 2. Fennec Fox The Fennec Fox is the smallest of all the world's foxes, but its large ears, measuring up to 15 centimeters, appears to be on loan from a bigger relative. The fennec fox is an adorable little animal that's native to the Sahara Desert. These foxes are nocturnal and they have large ears that help them hear their prey underground. They have long, bushy tails and they're about the size of a cat. They are very curious animals and they're also known for being playful. Fennec foxes have many desert adaptations including fur-covered feet, heat-radiating ears, and pale fur that offers excellent camouflage in the sand. Plus, they can go without water for long periods of time. Fennec foxes are nocturnal, which means they hunt at night, and when they hunt, they do this alone, using their large ears to listen for prey that's moving around underneath the desert sands. Once they locate their prey, they'll dig with all four paws to get a hold of their meal. Number 1. Honduran White Bat The Honduran White Bat is one of the cutest and most exotic animals in the world. These little guys are endangered and are found in Honduras, Nicaragua, Costa Rica, and the western parts of Panama. They have a yellow leaf-shaped nose and ears, and a black membrane on their wings. Their fur is pure white, hence their name, and parts of their limbs are a wonderful bright orange. They are nocturnal creatures, so you'll rarely see them during the day, but at night, they're out and about eating and socializing. 
Their diet consists of insects, fruit, and pollen. Fun fact, Honduran white bats are the only known species of bat to use a leaf tent made out of leaves to sleep in during the day. Using their teeth, the bats cut along the ribs of heliconia leaves to create a folded tent-like structure. Which animal did you like the most? Let us know in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn the notification on so you won't miss any upcoming videos. See you next time.